It's a sunny morning at the Ninoy Aquino International Airport as airlines have resumed operations. Runways and parking bays are again filled with planes flying in and out of the airport. The scheduled maintenance service for the runways on Tuesday midnight was suspended. This allowed Naia to accommodate 80 more flights. Inside the airport, huge crowds of passengers started lining up at check-in counters even before sunrise. They had waited for long hours as their flights were cancelled yesterday with the onslaught of Typhoon Nina. About 80,000 passengers were affected as airlines cancelled almost 400 flights. But some passengers have to wait a little longer, like Susan Junella and her husband. Their flight to Davao is rescheduled to Thursday as earlier trips are all fully booked. They have no choice but sleep on a cardboard mat for two more nights. Kasi hirap naman kasi umuwi pa kami ng Marilo, Bulacan eh. eh. ano yung dala namin, mabigat. Tapos ang mahal yung mga taxi maningil. Jenny Yosalina's arrival in Manila from Kuwait was also delayed because of the stormy weather. She missed her connecting flight to Davao and she was not rebooked by her budget carrier. Yosalina was forced to buy another ticket from a rival airline at double the price. Sabi niya hindi pwede bili kayo ng bagong ticket. Ginaganon, sabi ko sama-sama naman ito. But for these travelers, it's worth the wait, as long as they can be with their loved ones before New Year's Eve. Officials are reminding passengers to call their airline or travel agent first before heading to the airport. This is to check if their flight is confirmed. Uh, wag ho silang pupunta sa pariparan kung hindi ho nakabuk ang kanilang flights dahil lahat ho flights ngayon ang pagkakalam po po. Halos lahat po no. Passengers can also reach the airport hotlines and SMS number if they have more concerns. Rex Remitio, CNN, Philippines.